<laughs> the official purpose of Senator George Mitchell's trip is fact-finding, and a new fact is about to emerge, one that informs sources here call politically explosive. A 262-page secret government report first obtained by the respected daily paper Haaretz shows that the military has turned a blind eye to the expansion of Israeli settlements on Palestinian-owned land. Under international law, the military is responsible for policing the occupied territories and safeguarding Palestinian rights, including land ownership. Eight years ago, Senator Mitchell recommended a freeze on new construction in the settlements. That became a key element in the Washington-backed roadmap to peace. What's happening now is more like a roadblock. Israeli settlements are expanding at record speed, taking up more and more of the land that was supposed to become the Palestinian state one day. An Israeli human rights group that monitors the construction on a daily basis says it grew by 60 percent last year. Eventually, even if there will be a peace treaty with the Palestinian, it will be almost impossible to implement it on the ground. And that's because every settlement house becomes a family home. And uprooting that is as hard as making a peace deal. Alan Pizzi, CBS News, on the West Bank.